really great sequence for detoxifying and cleansing the body is Surya Namaskar, the sun salutations. So let's move through this flowing sequence together. Uh, this is a great sequence to do first thing in the morning to get the body moving, to get the synovial fluid going, lubricating the joints, and freeing up the body for the day. So we'll start with a series of joint uh, freeing poses. We'll start to shift the weight into one foot. Take the opposite foot back onto the big toe and just circle around on that big toe. So with a lot of focus here on the hip joint, but letting the leg feel very loose in the joint. And then change the direction of your circles. Again, just bringing some synovial fluid up into that hip joint to get things moving for the day. Let's go ahead and switch sides to the opposite side. Again, using your balance, strengthening the core here to hold the body here. We'll take that foot back and create some circles here. And then change the direction of those circles. And then we'll take the feet right back up underneath the hips and draw the attention to the tip of the nose and we'll start to make some circles with the nose. Circling the air, just creating some movement in the neck. You may hear a little popping and cracking in the neck and that's okay. And then go ahead and change the direction of your circles here. So all the while we're keeping the core very strong keeping the navel just gently drawing back towards the spine. Coming to stillness here, draw your attention to your shoulders. Start to lift the shoulders up by the ears, bring the shoulder blades together down your back and let them slide down the back, creating these great big circles with the shoulders. So we'll move in this direction a couple of times and then we'll change the direction. So bringing the shoulders forward and again, just getting those shoulder joints lubricated for the day. And so now we'll take the hands and bring them together, bring the heels of the hands together, interlace the fingers, bring the elbows together, and lift those elbows as high as the heart. And then just begin to circle the wrists around. So again, getting some synovial fluid into the wrists as we'll be doing some downward facing dog. This will be helpful if the wrists are warmed up. Moving in the opposite direction. Great. And then go ahead and release the hands. Step your feet a little bit wider, about as wide as, a little wider than the hips actually. Take the arms out to the side and then just start to swing the arms side to side, giving the opposite shoulder a little tap. And really let that hand on the back body give the kidneys a little wake up. So just a nice tap on the back of the body. And find a little bit of a twist in your spine. So let the shoulders get involved here as you turn side to side. Beautiful. And so now we'll come back to center and start to draw your attention to your tailbone and begin to make circles on the floor with your tailbone. So creating these great big circles, again getting into the hip joints here and then changing the direction of the circles, hitting all the major joints in the body. Nice firm core as you move. Great. And then we'll bring those circles to stillness, step the feet together Big toes are together, the heels are slightly apart, keeping the heart lifted, nice tall spine. Put a deep bend in the knees, let the hands slide down to the knees and start to circle these knees around. So the focus here really is the ankles, we're getting into the ankle joints. So you wanna stay lifted here in the heart, keeping the chin up and just circling the knees around and then change the direction of your circles. And then we'll start to rise up to standing. And again, step the feet a little wider than the hips. And now bring that awareness again to the tailbone. And we'll start to just lean forward, sticking that tailbone out behind you. Draw the tailbone forward and let that movement ripple up the spine. So notice how the head follows last. Okay, so the chin is tucked as we ripple through the spine here, just warming up all the joints of the body. Beautiful. And then we'll release, step the feet together, and we're ready for our sun salutations. So that may be enough of a warm up for you, or maybe that's all the time you have. If you can at least do that sequence every single morning, it's so helpful just to help the joints be lubricated and move freely through the day. 
But if you want to break a little bit of a sweat, remove some of that kapha from the morning, uh, from waking in the morning with all that kapha built up in the body. We'll move through a series of sun salutations. So coming to the top of your mat, your feet are just about hip width apart. So take a nice deep breath in, inhale, reach up through the fingertips, and then exhale, fold over the legs. Feel free to put a nice deep bend in the knees if need be. And as you fold over, you'll let go of the head, and then bend deeply into the knees. Look forward, sit the hips down, and then exhale and fold again over the legs. Plant the hands firmly here, and on an inhale, step your right foot back. Let the knee come to the earth. Press into this front foot and inhale. Sweep your arms up and overhead. Lift your gaze up to the fingertips. And then exhale, the hands plant down around that front foot. The front foot steps back into plank pose. So here in plank pose, gathering the navel towards the back of the spine, and you have the option to come here into plank pose or to bring the knees to the earth. You begin to bend into the elbows. Elbows are tucked in towards the body. Bring just the chin and the chest to the earth so the hips are sticking up high and then begin to slide down onto the belly. Find your tailbone, press it into the earth and just lift the heart very slightly. Exhale, shift your hips back towards your heels just touching on a child's pose here. The toes are curled. We need to lift the hips up to the sky, stepping the feet just under the hips. And exhale as you sink into the heels. Let go of the head, and your gaze is at the navel. Your heels may or may not touch the earth. It doesn't matter. And then taking that same foot that stepped back in the beginning, we'll bring that foot forward. Step both feet together, rise up halfway, nice flat spine here, exhale and fold over the legs. Soften the knees, inhale and rise up. Again, looking up at the fingertips, exhale, bring the palms together, hands to the heart. Beautiful. So that was one round of sun salutations. So now we'll move with a little more flow. Inhale, sweep the arms, exhale and fold. Inhale, rise halfway, exhale, fold. Inhale, step the left foot back, knee to the earth, sweep the arms overhead, gaze lifts to the fingertips, exhale and fold. Inhale, step back, plank or knees to the earth, chin and chest to the earth, sliding forward, hips come down last, Press the tailbone down as you lift the heart. Exhale, shift, child's pose. Toes are curled as you lift the hips to the sky. Step the feet under the hips and let the heels sink down. Gaze to the navel. The shoulders are very soft here and there's no effort to hold the head. Just let it dangle. Left foot steps forward between the hands. Right foot follows, halfway, exhale. Soft knees, inhale, press the earth away as you rise up to standing. Hands to the heart. Let's through, move through three more rounds of our sun salutations. Inhale, exhale and fold. Inhale, bend the knees looking forward. Exhale and fold. Inhale, right foot steps back, knee to the earth. Sweep the arms overhead, lift the gaze. Exhale, hands to earth. Left foot steps back, plank. Chin to the earth. Tailbone presses as we lift the heart. Shifting back to child's pose. Curl the toes, lift into downward facing dog. Take a pause here. Sink the heels in. The right foot steps forward between the hands. Left foot follows. Exhale and fold. Press the earth away. Inhale, rise. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, follow right through. Exhale, lead with your heart as you fold. Bend the knees, look forward. Exhale. Left foot steps back, knee to earth. 
Inhale, sweep the fingertips. Exhale, hands to earth. Inhale, right foot steps back, plank pose, or knees. Bring the chin and chest all the way through. Rest the tailbone. Shift back, child's pose. Curl the toes and lift. Downward facing dog. Take a breath. Let it all out. Left foot steps forward. It may take a few steps for you to get here. That's okay. Rising halfway. Exhale, fold. Soften your knees as you push the earth away. Rise up. Fingertips overhead. Hands to heart. Two more rounds. Inhale, sweep. Exhale, fold. Inhale, bend the knees. Exhale, fold. Inhale, right foot steps back, knee to earth. Inhale and sweep. Exhale and fold. Inhale, step back. Exhale, chin to earth. Sliding through, slight lift. Exhale, child's pose. Inhale, downward facing dog. Find your feet, settle in, take a breath. Let go of the effort in the head and the neck. Press into the hands, press into the heels. Lift the hips towards the sky. Right foot steps forward between the hands. Left foot follows, halfway lift, exhale, fold. Soft knees, inhale, rise up. Exhale, hands to heart. Last round as we inhale, sweep the arms up and overhead. Exhale and fold. Inhale, rise halfway. Exhale. Inhale, left foot steps back. Fingertips to the sky. Exhale and fold. Inhale, both feet together. Knees to the earth, chin and chest. Slide through. Slight lift of the heart. Exhale, child's pose. Inhale, lift, downward facing dog. Pause here. Notice your breath. Notice a little heat in the body. Take that left foot forward. Step the right foot and fold. Inhale, press the feet into the earth. Rise up, hands to heart. Beautiful. So this is a beautiful way to start your day. A little bit of a sweat on the brow, feeling the heart beating, feeling the blood moving through the body, just feeling warmed up and ready to go. I hope you enjoy. Have a really wonderful day.